Hey friends, hey guys. You probably can't hear me over the fan, probably not, but I'm in a different location. I am in a hotel room all alone in my town on the beach. So I thought I would just, you know, film this experience because I have never, ever, ever in my life been alone, um, ever for 24 hours. And that's exactly what I'm doing. It's Sunday, it's Father's Day. We spent the day by the pool at my mom's, hung out, let John sleep in, do all the dad things. And this is like part of my birthday experience is back when I was feeling overwhelmed, I said, I need just 24 hours to do nothing, to lay in bed and do nothing. So we booked this hotel a while ago and then magically I started laying up down and he slept all night. Doesn't matter, I'm gonna give you a hotel tour. You guys are gonna spend the time with me. We are gonna hang out together. If you are a mom who's overtouched, burnt out, just struggling, just giving you all my love because I totally understand. And I wish everybody had an opportunity to do something like this because it's healing to say the very least. Just walking in here and being alone, I'm like, one, I'm kind of sad, two, I'm like, this is, I'm gonna take advantage of this and do absolutely nothing. There's bars everywhere, it's wild here, but I'm gonna stay in the room. <laughs> Let's do a room tour, shall we? It's a suite, um, it's a Marriott Spring Hills. It's super cute. You walk in the door and there's this like little living room area, a fridge, a microwave, a little coffee machine, how fun. A desk, what? My dinner that I picked up on the way here, how fun is that? <laughs> I picked up my favorite barbecue because um, I fully plan on staying in. So I got my dinner. There's TV, a big old bed, this really cute bathroom situation. It's like a farm door. And this adorable little bathroom. The best part is this view. This is my hometown, y'all. And it is popping. It is popping down there. There is so many people. That girl down there is passed out if you can zoom in. She is sleeping, love that for her. And the beach is packed obviously because it's Father's Day weekend. And I am at the busiest part of our beach. It looks so beautiful. That is my plan tomorrow is I'm gonna lay out and on the beach by myself. But I don't know guys, what do I freaking do with myself? It's a little steamy in here. First I gotta fix the AC. It's like the first thing I, oh it's already dropped a degree. Yes, baby, I want it cold, I want it nice cold. Suitcase tour. This is what I packed for an overnight stay alone. I'm, it's already like 5 p.m. too. Like it's literally like the end of the day. I'm literally spending the night, waking up in the morning, and going to the beach, but. Ta-da! But, I'll show you why. First of all, my purse. This is fake, by the way. It's a fake, it's a fluey. I brought like skincare, my razors, exfoliating, hair mask. I'm gonna show you because I'm literally going to self care the shit out of myself. That sounds weird. I have to bring my own pillows because I'm over 30. There goes my CVS bag because I'm over 30 and if I don't have my Tempur-Pedic, I'm gonna wake up with a crick in my neck. <laughs> I just, I need my pillows. So I brought my hugging pillow. This is the one I hug at night. And then I brought my laying on pillow. That's like a Tempur-Pedic and it has a little humpier for your neck. Let me know if you guys bring your own pillows. My mom brings her own pillows when we travel too. It's just what we do. Okay, right here and right here. Welcome home, girls. And then I brought like 100 bathing suit choices, all in black. John calls me beach gothic chic. I just call my dad, because my dad travels for a living, so he booked this week for me with, um, what is it called? Hotel points. My hair's still wet from the pool earlier. But he booked this hotel, so I just called him and showed him the view and everything. Actually, I'm gonna open up and like stare at the ocean while I'm talking to you. Stand by. That's what I'm talking about. He booked this for me with hotel points because he travels all the time. So him getting a room like this is nothing to him. Looking at the ocean from your bed, uh, from right here, I could cry a little bit. But I brought like a bunch of like, self-care stuff tell me what you would do this might sound silly like you're some people might be like i'd go out or i you think should go out to dinner like i literally want to be alone i don't want to talk to anybody except you guys i love you i don't know why i feel like i'm gonna cry that's a good thing i haven't been able to cry in forever because of my meds no i don't want to be touched i don't want to be talked to like i literally i am over touched like my especially my youngest he's on top of me all the time and i love him and i i gladly soak it in and I'll miss it tonight I will miss him 
but like I just need to like self-care so I'm literally going to self-care I brought a detoxifying treatment mask a hair mask a face mask a sheet mask I also got myself a huge giant water um, I don't know <laughs> I got a toothbrush I got a, like a travel one and a face mist. I'm just gonna like lay here. I have a towel, bathing suits, and I'm just, I don't know. I'm gonna watch the Kardashians. First, I'm gonna take a really hot shower and shave my legs. I don't know, guys. What would you do? I, Cause when I was talking on Instagram about this, everybody was like so on board and gets it. Like I feel like the people who get it, get it because we're, I'm never alone. I haven't been alone in years, years and years and years. And I love my life and I love my family, but like staring at the ocean alone, watching what I want, eating when I want, taking the longest shower of my entire life and not hearing or thinking about the noise in the background. And once all these people clear off, cause our beach is a driving beach, once these people clear off, it'll be even better. I'm gonna sit on the porch, but there are so many drunk people out there right now, it's crazy. <laughs> I just not in the mood for that. I'm not drinking. I'm just hanging. You guys, taking my meds. <laughs> and I just, I took, hold on. The Kardashians are playing and my hair is air drying. I'm binge watching the Kardashians cause like it's literally, I never watch anything anymore. So I've decided I'm gonna put a face mask on. It's 8 p.m. I just took a melatonin, a kid's melatonin. So it's like one milligram. I'm gonna do like a berry mask. I'm so tired. Like, so sleepy. But we were in the sun all day, so I'm assuming that's probably why. The bed, I, th I swear to you, Helix has completely ruined me. Like, I can't even, I can't, no bed I sleep on or lay on, I'm like, mm. I like know the, I notice the quality of it now. I don't even know who I am. I sound like an old lady. I literally sound like a 75 year old woman. I'm like, let me bring my neck pillow, the quality of the mattress. Let me put on my little face mask and take my medicine before bedtime. I'll be out in an hour. <laughs> Cheers. But I have a big day plan in the sun tomorrow. You would think that I would sleep in. Not I, not this girl, not me. No way, no how. So I decided to watch the sunset or sunrise. Sunrise, sunset, sunrise, sunset. Who knows that movie? Top of the morning to ya. This is the only sunscreen I have, so I'm putting it on. My mom, well, I woke up saw the sun rise it's beautiful and my dad was walking on the beach and he's like hey look out your window and there's my dad how nice was that it was so sweet and my mom was like i'll bring you coffee in the morning and like a, a bagel and i was like oh that sounds nice it's 8 a.m and i've been up for two hours no it's 8 4 14. oh <laughs> i need coffee so i didn't fall asleep last night until like 11 o'clock i finished watching the kardashians I will say my bed at home is more comfortable though, but can't beat the view. Future Lauren here to uh, give you an update. The bed sucked and I feel like I'm ruined for life, mostly because um, my Helix mattress is the best mattress that I've ever slept on in my life, sponsored or not sponsored, which this video just so happens to be sponsored by Helix. And I have talked about this mattress for years now and it absolutely 1000% lives up to the hype, 1000%. It's ruined me for life. I can't sleep anywhere. I was in a hotel room on the beach and I was still like, mm, mm This is nothing like my bed at home. There is no bed quite like my bed. Uh, if you don't know, Helix is a mattress that is delivered straight to your door. You go online and you take a sleep quiz and it will match you with the mattress that is best suited for you. My favorite, favorite, favorite thing about Helix is that they make plus size mattresses. So, or mattresses for plus size people. You know what I'm saying? They make mattresses for plus size people. We took the sleep quiz and we were matched with the Helix Plus and it is completely 1000% changed my life. We have one in the nursery as well. It's a twin version of that mattress. It's held up beautifully. I literally, at the end of the day, when I hit my bed, I know for sure I'm going to sleep good. Even if it's a limited amount of sleep, I know I'm going to sleep good. I have less back pain. I have less shoulder pain. 
Um, it's just, I can't even say enough good things. And you guys, all of you have purchased Helix mattresses as well. Love them. They now also offer financing. So a great night's sleep is just a click away if you guys wanna check it out because financing options are great. You can just make payments on it, which is super nice. They also have really, really great bed accessories. They have the best sheets ever. I wash them weekly. They've held up beautifully and they stay super white. I don't, it's not like I use bleach or anything, but they've like stayed perfectly perfect. And a really, really nice thing about Helix is you can sleep on it for 100 nights. And if you don't love it, you can send it back for free. So there's a hundred nights you can sleep on it to test drive it. And you're like, Hey, this is not the mattress for me. You can go ahead and send it back. I cannot say enough good things about Helix. They have absolutely been a game changer for our family. And now I feel like I can't go anywhere or do anything or sleep. Mostly I can go anywhere and do anything, but if I'm not sleeping in my bed, I'm, I'm very, I'm very, I'm very critical of mattresses. Very. I almost wanted to write a letter to the hotel guy like, hey, this is not acceptable. If you guys want to try Helix for yourself, you can go ahead and go to helixsleep.com slash Lauren Brazy and get up to $200 off of your mattress plus two free pillows. Now we can go ahead and get back to um, my little mommy, uh, mommy alone time. But I just had to say that mattress and it was like an expensive room. I feel when you lay your head down at night in a hotel, a bed is so important. Every Airbnb I've stayed at lately has had, well actually except for the one that we stayed at in North Carolina, their mattress was okay. But like the one in the beach last year was horrible. I'm just like such a mattress snob now. There is no mattress better than the Helix Plus. I said what I said. And if you have one, leave a comment down below and stand by me because I'm telling you, it's game changer. John said the kids did great. They both slept all night long. He didn't sleep though because when I'm gone, he just literally will stay up <laughs> to like check their breathing. It's the funniest thing ever because when he's gone, I just sleep. <laughs> Cause I'm like, hey, we'll be all right. He's such a good dad. Ella asked where I was and he said I was working <laughs> because for some reason that just seems to help her. But Ella asked for me, which is sweet. She wanted to know where mama was. All right, I'm showing you guys today's beach outfit you can't really see it there's my legs it's time to go baby y'all i said i was gonna show you around my hometown but like i am not walking these streets with tourists and i'm not being mean it is just so busy because it's summer so like the streets are already packed at 9 a.m so i went and got me a little i checked out I went and checked out, went and got me a little Starby, a little Starbucks. I have my chair in the back, which I gotta show you guys. John got it for me for my birthday because I'm a fatty and I wanted a chair that would hold me. And we found a chair at Walmart for a really good price that has like a crazy weight limit. Also, I posted a reel that had me real out of my comfort zone in my bathing suit. I'm feeling myself. Probably because I'm not sweaty yet because I didn't have to like pack a bag pack a diaper bag, get the toys, get all the baby stuff, put sunscreen on them because you know that's about the equivalent of wrestling an alligator. This is not good for you. I have SPF on my face, we saw that. I got this, John got this for me, the Australian Gold Spray Gel Sunscreen. It's got instant bronzer in that, which is kind of nerve wracking. Oh, but it smells like my high school years. So I'm gonna put it on. Probably super dumb, but I'm gonna do it. How bronzing is this? It doesn't look like it's making me bronze. Anyway, I also have a board meeting tonight. <laughs> so I don't know how long I'm gonna end up staying here and like away from my family because it's already like 9.30 and I'm like, I miss my babies. So I don't foresee me, foresee me being here that long. But like I said, every parent with small children needs this. It's iconic. It really is. Iconic. Just to like, be a human by yourself for a little bit of time. No, like I don't have any friends with me. Like I'm literally alone, alone. And it's a beautiful thing. And if you're not the kind of person who likes to be alone, then it might not be for you. But I personally love to be alone. <laughs> and I'm never alone. I really do enjoy being alone. I don't know, maybe I'm a weirdo. I don't think so. This is the chair. It says oversized for extra comfort. Oh, holds up to 350 pounds. There you go. 
Ayo! It's so great. It's so sturdy and it's comfortable and it has a little thing on the back. I love it so much for me. Also, you guys have seen this beach a hundred thousand times, but this is my beach. Back where I was yesterday, except today I got my boy with me. We dropped Ella off at therapy and she's only in therapy for a couple hours. So we hit the park. It was fun. <clears throat> a little bit hot. It's actually really nice out today considering. I don't know if this person's fully next to me. They're probably gonna be like, why does this lady have a camera? And then we went and grabbed some breakfast on the go and we came to the beach on a spur of the moment because I renewed my beach pass on my car because why not? But I have to say that little getaway for me, I feel like it was a brand new refresher for mama. I feel so much more refreshed and ready to take on the day and being touched constantly by somebody it's always you know you know how it is it's like somebody always needs something to eat drink do they're bored it's always something and mama is the the one <laughs> so it was it was really honestly so nice so freaking nice I feel better a lot better I didn't feel too bad but like you know, it's just weird times out here. So, we're gonna go kill some more time before we have to go pick up Sissy, huh? You dropped your Sammy. All right, let's go.